state, we come to the great place called Kansas City, and we got, <gasps> what is this? A company that's been around actually since 1932, serving white tablecloth restaurants, the Kansas City State Company. You know, I don't have to tell you about my in-laws, right? Hello, Jim and Connie. They love, love, love this brand, and you're doing this for the one-time only value, saving $42 from the QVC price, but my, my friend who is joining us right now, Chef Ralph Pellerino, what are these in a steakhouse? What are these in the white tablecloth steakhouse right now? Purr, right? Big, big old New York strip. Ah, whoa, right? Big time. Because these are not four. They're not six. Eight. They're not eight. Nope. No, they're ten, ten ounce. <laughs> these are big guys, right? Yeah. These are, and there's no bone. So this is all meat. Like, let's just look at one in its entirety right here. Okay, uh -huh. right in the. So look at that. This is 10 ounces, super trim. We leave just enough fat so that felt mat, felt melts into that steak. But what is a strip steak? What is, what, let what, me ask you this again. Go ahead. What's a strip steak? Okay. A strip steak, first of all, it's the top three coveted steaks. You have filet mignon mm -hmm. and ribeye mm -hmm. and, of course, New York strip. What I love about the difference between the New York strip is it grabs a little bit from each of those steaks, right? So it grabs a little of that marbling from the ribeye. Absolutely, a lot it of marbling from the It grabs a little bit of that tenderness from the flake. Yeah. But the difference, the big difference is that it has a bite. It has a chew. It has a mouthfeel that you don't get yeah. from a flaming Are you going to cut me a slice? You just I got you right here. I got your own pile right here. Come on. Let's yeah. go in. I'm ready to go. Hey, um, here's how it works. Mm, that's, oh, man, that's right. good. You know what I mean by that? The mouthfeel, it's got oh, a little no bit of about. chew. Yeah. No, you can do the blindfold on this one and know which one's a strip. Yeah, that's different. Right? Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's got a great flavor. By the way, two, four, six, eight of these, yeah. and then the 10 ounce over a salad, okay. Mm -hmm. the, the surf and turf with, yeah. with Egg Harbor coming up, yeah. or individually, you just want a fantastic steak, and they're going to come individually packaged. Yeah, just like this. So I want, to, I want people to see a couple things. First of all, we see that marbling. See those white lines? With a New York strip, like I said, it grabs a little bit from each of those coveted steaks. So when you look Five at this, remaining. it's got that the ribeye type of marbling, right? And then you get the tenderness of the filet, okay? Now, if you're a New York strip guy, we call these strip steaks. Mm -hmm. Kansas City strip steaks. New York tried to steal. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You heard about, the, oh, you're from New York? Oh, I'm sorry, but this is a Kansas City strip steak, mm. okay? Yeah. Not a New York strip anymore? No. Technically, it is a strip steak, <laughs> but people like to kind of, you know. <laughs> right, right, they, they, they brand it yeah, as if that's a better like version of it. that's their steak. Right? Yeah, right. Yeah. Well, guess what? You're doing just fine right here. But here's what I love about the Kansas City Steak Company. Yeah. Um, I love the consistency of it. Yes. When my in-laws get those fillets, they love, we send them, we say, hello, Jim and Connie. We love, and we get those fillets, and we love the consistency of your steaks. Love the consistency of your sirloin. So come on in, and now get the big old 10-ounce strips, and one's not going to be, oh, that was a little fatty, or that one's just no. not quite as good, no. or that one's a little, uh, I don't know, not you know, a little stringy, or a little something. So the consistency is going to be there, and this becomes an incredible gift. I got a birthday coming up. Uh, anybody, there's still time on the 12th of January, there's still time. But January birthstone babies, right? The guy, the father, the father-in-law, yeah. or an anniversary coming up. We have done this so many times, yeah. an anniversary, and you send them these, and then instead of a $150 gift card for one meal, one meal, That's you right. get, here's a meal for two. That's right. Here's a meal for two. Yeah. Here's a white cloth uh, dinner for two. Here's another one. It becomes a wonderful way to say, we love you. It's in their own, it's in their yeah. own home, and there's so many ways to do it. Now, with a strip, it's also a versatile cut of meat. Yeah, so you got a salad here. And then what I love about 400 this. 400 remaining, by the way, and that's going to be sold out. All right, I want to look at this for a second. It's 10 ounces, Rick, right? So if we slice a whole one, you put this out in the middle of the table, this is an, a course for maybe two or three people because the richness, like just like a ribeye, mm. the tenderness of just like a filet, mm. but you get the mouthfeel, the chew, of the strip steak, but you put it out just like this with some potatoes, and look at that. That's beautiful. That's what they're doing in the steakhouses, by the way. Okay, by the way, as, as, you're, as you're shopping right now, yes. you're gonna get it. I see it, it's individually packaged. I get it at home, I bring it out. Now give me the perfect Ralph tip. Perfect steak, medium rare. How do you make it? Do you let it sit for a while, like, okay. like for 30 minutes? First of all, great question, because when you talk about a New York strip, you shouldn't go past medium well. Mm -hmm. You just should. You should serve it medium to medium rare because you really want to capture all those flavors, right? Because what happens is if you go medium well or over that, you're going to dry the steak out. Yeah. So take advantage of the fact that it's got lots of marbling, lots of juice. Do you get the seasoning with this too? You don't get the seasoning with this. This one. one. You just get to get that's so, okay. right. salt, pepper. That's all you so, need. Can right? I tell you something? Here's my new trend. Here's the new tip of the year. Forgo the pepper and just kill it with salt. Get a nice, because what happens when you season a piece of meat, 
half of it falls out during the cooking process. So I go salt because sometimes pepper will intrude into that flavor of that steak. So All just right. go salt. Okay, that's a good tip. You like that tip? Okay, here's the update on it. Five Z payments of forty dollars, free shipping and handling. Lock into this. Here's you're getting two, four, six, eight of these. They're ten ounce. They're huge, individually packaged, and they're a one-time only value with free shipping. So the price right. goes away um, on these at the end of the show. Saving $43 from the regular QVC price. Big story. Okay, so now you said that there's a salt story. Right. Right, but I want to go, go beyond that. Now, when you're making it, right. are, you, are you searing it and you're searing and okay, roasting so it? Are you doing one let's, pan? Let's take it you're from start it? to finish. Okay, this is how it comes. Defrost it overnight in the fridge or in cold water. Just like this. You take it out of the package. You want to dry it. You want to get rid of any moisture possible because that's how you get that crust, just like in a steakhouse. Mm -hmm. So dry it really well and then hit it with a little bit of canola oil or olive oil. I do olive oil. Olive oil, and then get a hot screaming pan, mm -hmm. right? And just put it right in the pan for about five minutes. That's exactly on, what I do. On each side. And Jefferson then, carrying pan, yeah. sear it. Get it? Sear it. Don't touch really it. Really hot. Don't touch it. Mm -hmm. Don't move it around because you Turn want that even sear on each side. So yep. don't touch it. Then you're going to take it out and just let it sit. And what's going to happen for about five minutes, you see this juice? We let yeah. these sit. For, hey, Steve, how, how long did you let these sit, would you say? Eight minutes, okay? Steve, the stylist, he let these sit for eight minutes because he wants all those juices to, to stay in that steak. So when I cut it, it's not like a juice is pouring out because that juice, you want that in your mouth, Rick. Yeah. So let it sit. Let the juices go back into the meat, yeah. okay? Now, it's a strip steak. It's got that marbling. It's got that richness. And what I love, oh, yeah. Oh, I was waiting for you. Hi, Rob. How are you? You got to have, you got to have her own fork, though. Another fork? That's the same. That? No, 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 just, that's oh. my fork. Oh, is that? A fresh fork. <laughs> okay. Oh, I'm you're thinking about you. Okay. 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 Here you go. You're doing the right thing. Okay. Thank you. How dare you give her that fork? Right? You, you, now, I want now, you to think the, ribeye. What's the beef story? Think ribeye, filet, and Argentinian and Italian. Oh, so you know steak. Argentinians you know are big, big steak the, lovers. So, what is, so what's going on here? It's like, it's like it's, required that you love beef. Yes, it is. It's uh -huh. required. My father, we grew up that way, making beef. And I agree with you it's about a, the, but I wouldn't say kill it with salt. I would say salt it, but you don't have to kill I mean, it. I mean the action. I mean the action because oh, oh, Rick likes oh, action. Oh. I mean, yeah, but boom. yes, simple, simple is always best. And when you have this type of flavor, this deep, deep beef flavor, is that is what you get with the North yes. York strip. You don't need to do anything else, but just cook it beautifully as is. And you're right. You know what you killed me with, Rick? And you're right. I wrapped my head around it this way. Just two of these right here is what it would cost. No What's question. on the screen no is what question. it would cost if you went to, to uh, a, like a, 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 or even just a, a, salad, not even a five star restaurant. Asparagus. Right? But that's who we Something sell on the to. side. Right. You know? It's the same steak. You get to enjoy that experience in your house. Yes. No. Exactly. All you gotta do is cook it, which is very simple. And one, two, so, three, four. Here comes the update. Okay. Uh, two, four, six, eight of these, 10 ounce. If you want it, fewer than 500 now remaining in M95586. Only show at this price. We have it for you. It's our one-time only value. That right. goes up at the end of the show. And these are the strips. Tell me, if you will, uh, I want to go to the grocery store. Right. I want to go down the street. Mm -hmm. I want to go anywhere. I can get a strip. Tell me about the Kansas City State Company, because this is what, what you're most proud of. Yeah, what well, we're most proud of. First of all, we don't trust these in a, in a store. You can't get these in the store because we like to control that process. We've been here since 1932 at QVC since, I think, 1995. 1995. That says a lot. You're not around here if you're not doing something good. I believe it. You mentioned something, consistency, right? I mean, that's all we have is we have to be consistent because people say, well, I want to give this as a gift. I want this in my right. house. It's got to be good, else you're going to let a lot of people down. Okay, now we got one yeah. minute. Now, show okay. this guy wins best body language when he, when he does, when he works. Show the, show the bend over in the cut. and the, just, okay. just show that. Just uh, describe it at the same time. Well, it's, all in the, it's all in the legs, so right? Go, so I gotta go, get low. Go, go, go low, get in there. Get in there, right? Get in there, right? Now describe it. Look at that. Now kill it with salt. You do the do yeah. your. Yeah, what yeah, you I wish I had Put some yeah, salt yeah, on there. Yeah. And boom. Yeah, so we're gonna just hit it with some balsamic. Boom. That, you don't ever do that. Okay. Uh, M95586, the Kansas City <laughs> State Company, and our one time only value, individually packaged for you. Yep. Yeah, thought out. Salt it. Final thoughts. What'd you bring to us, Ralph? What's the strip all about? The, the Kansas strip, City strip. It, it literally steals a little bit from the tenderloin and the ribeye. So you get the best of all those worlds in one steak, but it has the chew. You gotta have the chew, the mouthfeel of a New York strip steak. Uh, you know, we go, go right with that, a surf and turf. We have it right now. Mm. That's the surf. Uh, that's the turf. Here comes the surf. The surf is coming up next with an item that I am adamant about. 
I love if you had like, what's my top two or three or four en uh, entrees when it comes to QVC and our culinary world. This is right there at the top of the list.